Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today in Scratch we will be creating a easy and simple pawn game. So let's go right into it. So first of all I'm going to create my character. Paint, I'm going to call this player. You can call it platform or anything you like. And this is my favorite color orange. Uh, if you like this color too, it's 10, saturation 100, brightness 100. Okay, now let's zoom in, and let's make a line, I'll make it probably 30, 30, and 10, 100, 100, okay, shift, if you press shift at the same time, it should create a perfect, um, platform, whatever, or whatever you like to call it. I'll put it in the middle, just like that. That's the most important part. And now, okay. When clicked, forever, we want to set the X to, I'll zoom in, to mouse X so that it follows you everywhere you go. And now let's create the ball. Of course, without ping pong, you can't have the ball. Like, Without the ball, you can't have ping pong. <laughs> uh, ball. Okay, let's just make this a normal ball. Ah, no! What did I do? Huh? Eighty. Eighty-eight, maybe. Uh, I'll make this also ten. Oh, that seems so big. That is so big. Okay, about this much. 27 by 27 pixels. That seems about right. <clears throat> now for the coding for the ball. When clicked, I'll zoom out. When clicked, forever. Uh, you want to first. make the direction into 45 degrees which is about that much and we want to forever move 10 steps and then uh, if on edge we want it to bounce so as you can see it is going like a ping pong ball okay now, but there's gonna be a problem when, like, when we're gonna make this, make it touch. So, if touching mouse pointer, nope, player. Now, let's take out, move 10 steps and duplicate it, put it in there. And let's take out the 45, point direction for 45 degrees and do that. Like this, the code should look like this, if touching player. Okay, so the problem is that every time it touches this, it does work, but um, as you can see, it's just going in a direction of this way, only that way. It's not going like randomly, so the, it's going to be so easy for the player that it's going to be boring. So now, instead of this, we're going to kick it up a notch and make it into negative 45 and this one into positive 45 or just 45 um, so now if you try it out it's gonna go between negative 45 and 45 so it goes 45 and then as you can see it goes there like n into the negatives wow this is really cool now now the player won't know that it's gonna keep going this way or that way <laughs> so now we're gonna have to create the score. Make a variable called uh, not scratch a c o r e. Enter, and then now we're gonna get a a new or maybe let's just go to player. Let's create a new when clicked forever forever if 
touching. Uh, touching. Where's that touching? Sensing. Yep. If touching ball, then we want to change not my variable score by one, and then we want to set our score to zero. Oh, I made it into, oops, score, score, I need score. Hmm. As you can see, there's a problem. Maybe, I think it would work if we just put it in the ball, ball one. Oh, hey, work. Now it should be in the ball. Let's just take this one out. And... And instead of the ball, we're going to make it into player. Okay, I think I know the problem. Move 10 steps. Let's actually just change it into move 1 step. Hmm. Oh my god. Wow. The score is definitely going up. <laughs> but it's way too fast. Way too fast. Oh. Now as you can see it works. It works. Hmm. Okay, now, if it touches the ground, it should lose, not just keep bouncing around. <clears throat> so, now let's go to paint, get a uh, uh, touched, I'm just going to make it touched ground. Okay, I'm trying to break my record on a tutorial. Five minutes. Five minutes or less. I'm just... So, um, outline. I'm going to make it red. Red. Okay, well, this much should be right. No, no. We also wanted to make it shift to stay straight. About that much. Yep. Okay, now let's let's just take uh, go to backdrops and uh, space space neon tunnel. I like the neon tunnel and okay. Nope, we're gonna do that. Okay, so one clicked forever if. Touching ground, like if, if touched ground, touched ground, then we want to stop all. We want to just make it stop all. So, just like that, it stops everything. So, yeah, guys, we just made a ping pong game I'm hoping less than five minutes hopefully so yeah guys I better end the video and I'll see you guys next time bye